15K. Oh, lots of emails today. Here's one. Dear Professor McDonald, I am in your human resources class that meets on Thursday. I have a question about the portfolio assignment that is due next week. Can you ex please explain what you're looking for in the elements of the FMLA? Okay. I've looked at the rubric and would like clarification on how much detail you want included. Thank you, Kyle Thomas. Well, this is going to be pretty, um, pretty easy for me to do. Dear Kyle, thank you so much for reaching out in advance of the class. The FMLA is complicated in many regards because it's a federal law and there are, very, there are a lot of nuances to it. I would say choosing this subject is one that will allow you to explore the federal guidelines, but also look at what you can do to expand FMLA in your own company, if that's possible. Think of what FMLA stands for, Family Medical Leave Act. So what would that mean for you as an individual or for a family? You get 12 weeks. How can that 12 weeks be used for you, your family? Um, could it be used for your cousin or could it be used for your aunt? Could it be used for your mother or your father? There are a lot of nuances to explore. Likewise, some companies are more flexible with FMLA and they give more time. For instance, if your company allows you to accumulate sick leave days, would you for, let's say, six months, would you use, let, them let, let them use that six months in addition to or included as a part of FMLA? Give this some thought and see what you would like to do with this in the Kyle Thomas company, for instance. I would also suggest that you look at the federal guidelines and that you also look at some companies, both private and public, so that you can get an idea of how many people use it, utilize FMLA. Also, for some bonus points, what does FMLA mean when you include it with, let's say, workers' compensation or ADA, Americans with Disabilities Act? There are a lot of nuances that can change how you administer these plans. I think giving some information about this would be beneficial for you, and it's something that the class would really be enlightened with, both in their personal lives and in their professional lives. It's always good information that you'll be able to share. Kyle, thank you. I look forward to hearing from you, and I certainly look forward to seeing what you would do with FMLA based on general standards, and based on what you might do if this was the Kyle Thomas Company. I look forward to seeing you on Thursday. Thank you.